Every holiday season, hundreds of lives are lost due to drunk drivers. And nationally, over the past five years, an average of 300 people died in drunk driving crashes the week before Christmas and New Year's. That's a lot of people and what's supposed to be a jolly time of year. So, Carlos, talk to us about all the safety campaigns that are out there right now to bring awareness to this. Definitely. The Department of Transportation works a lot with the local community and also it's statewide with a lot of different campaigns. Um, impaired driving is no exception. Right, um, right now is, we're probably starting that actually since Halloween all the way to New Year's is a big push on impaired driving awareness. Law enforcement will be cracking down on those that are you know, under the influence. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's something that we're actually looking in and supporting. Right. And I know that you do a lot of work with Miami Kids Magazine as well. Yes. So can you talk to us a little about your partnership and the importance of bringing information like this to the community? Certainly. Well, I'd like to thank uh, publicly Carla for having us <laughs> and <you>. for <laughs> partnering with us. Uh, we just uh, concluded a whole year of partnership with Miami Kids Magazine. And what that has allowed us is to c connect with the community and, and show our, our safety messages with the different campaigns right. that we have. Right now, we're finishing off the Put It Down campaign, the Distracted Driving Awareness campaign. I don't know if you can no see No text, that. no call, no nothing. Exactly. <laughs> so um, we like to get out in the community. And right. the best way is with partnerships. Uh, we have partnerships with magazines. We have partnerships with hospitals. We have partnerships with law enforcement and other uh, government agencies as well.